Hello guys, I am Sarah from 190. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year and welcome to my channel Thanksgiving Happy. This is my Christmas tree light special tutorial which I'd love to show you guys my new Christmas tree that I built. I built it today and I put Christmas lights all over it. It is the time in which I put my tree in the air or oh, I was gonna say erect my tree but as you can see behind me I have a green light flashing guys and that is pretty epic if you would like to know how to actually make any color light then I'll show you guys right in a moment it's very epic guys it's, it's very simple actually and it's just using glass a timer and yeah yeah basically two hoppers stuck together and that's how I get my Christmas lights so let's build a couple of them right now guys so you can get ready for Christmas so this is my Christmas tree flashing away in the night I like the way it's flashing right now. It's making me happy feeling. And so it's very easy to do, so let's get building. Okay, so what we're gonna need is two hoppers. We need a comparator and a redstone lamp. That's about it. Maybe a glass as well. We're gonna wanna pick what color glass you prefer. Usually Christmas lights, I'd say red and green maybe occasionally blue so what you want to do is get two hoppers crouch placed into each other so you crouch place press L2 and now they're inside of each other it's completely connected for Christmas so now you put a comparator facing out like this drop any block in and put your redstone lamp on the end or you can put a, rep a repeater a repeater then the light so you can slow the light flashing down you can either turn it up or down I don't think I'll use a repeater on my build but nonetheless this is red and you can see this is one red light and now I have a blue and green as well so from a distance maybe not that distance and at night time from about this distance here it starts to look like Christmas lights this is what gave me the idea and I was very I was very happy with this because they all flash at different times which is really cool so as you can see I'm standing on my Christmas tree does it look like a Christmas tree to you does that look like a Christmas tree? It's starting to look like one right a bit now. There we go. So basically it's about 13 snowflakes getting bigger up all the way to the top. And smaller, I mean, actually, all the way to the top. And one stalk for the tree, the branch, as that gets thinner up to the top as well. So that's a very basic design that I came up with this, uh, this morning on my own. I did all by myself. I'm very proud. And now all I need to do is put some Christmas decorations on this tree. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I do to make this this operation needs to be quick because this is a very, very slow thing. So let's, let's do the fastest method I found was to put uh, redstone lamps wherever you want the Christmas lights. So don't be too crazy, but be generous enough that you'll have about five or six on each branch. And the closer you get to the top, the less lights you're going to want. So the first thing I'm going to do is put those two hoppers together. I have to actually put a block, a solid block, so I can put my comparator on top. Unfortunately, you cannot put comparators on top of the leaves, which really sucks. But nonetheless, I found a way around it, so let's just do it like this. And put the glass, I chose blue, very rare, I'll, I'll just put a couple of blues. Mainly I'm going to use green and red for this illusion. And as you can see from a distance, it looks like we have our first Christmas light. And now we have the rest on the bottom. There we go, we have about five or six, I think, there. Let's put it uh, to night mode and check it out real quick. It looks pretty real to me. It looks pretty real. So let's continue all the way up to the top and check it again at night. And there you go, guys. Christmas lights. I didn't even worry about the timing. I, therefore, I not use, I use no repeaters whatsoever. They're just comparators. They all chose to go off at complete different times. It's completely random, as every time when you throw your block into the hoppers, yeah, it's just gonna be at whatever time you do that, so it's always gonna be random from each other.
here is a very quick look at my world as it's updating constantly, so I figured I might as well show you guys a little bit what I've done. Well, dear family and friends, this brings us to the end of the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I am Seraphim190. God. Almighty. Peace out. I'm gonna go to hell for that. I know it.